Galaxy S20 cuts, this is what we came here to discuss First phone with all of these features, S20 Ultra and the Plus Reaching in my pocket for them chips, trying to find a bad Z flip Snapdragon coming with me, A65. screen quality 120 hertz yeah, we live. Quick share when I wanna share some, Airdrop. take a whole punch in the center no problem. Have to make an intro here with some by 5G and Able We ain't never trying to stop, Woo. So let's get it poppin' right now in this video the Subscribe button right now while I play loud spit facts through bars on your stereo Squad what up y'all welcome back ck tech here man if this is your first time on the channel welcome this is a channel where i like to talk as well as rap about all things tech just like you heard in the intro of this video so if that is something you guys are interested in then definitely definitely click on that subscribe button down below as well as click on that notification bell man so that way you guys don't miss out on none of these dope videos your boy got coming y'all way all right so what are we talking about in today's video now today's video y'all i want to tell you guys about a product that i've had here on the channel for a while now uh, and I've done several several videos on it and that is the Samsung Galaxy Buds now the one I'm actually gonna be talking about is the upcoming Samsung Galaxy Buds Plus and letting you guys know pretty much everything that I'm personally excited for when it comes to the updated version 2 of the original Samsung Galaxy Buds which they are calling the Samsung Galaxy Buds Plus now uh, there's a couple things that I want to talk about and break this video down which I'll have right up here on the screen for you guys to check out and just letting you guys know the topics of everything we're going to be breaking down in this video. Very similar to what I did in the Samsung Galaxy S20 video, letting you guys know everything that I'm excited for when it comes to those devices. So uh, if you haven't seen that video, I will link that down in the description below as well as right up here on the card for you guys to check out. Now the very first thing I'm excited for is the price. Now the price of the upcoming Samsung Galaxy Buds Plus is going to start at 150 bucks now i'm excited for this man because as you already know the apple airpods pro these retail at 250 dollars so the fact that even with samsung's upcoming flagship model of their true wireless earbuds coming in still at a hundred dollars cheaper is no doubt going to be a big seller i think for samsung when it comes to the price for the Samsung Galaxy Buds Plus. I think that is a good price point because the original ones came in right at $130. So I am excited to see this new price that they're bringing on the Galaxy Buds Plus. Now the next thing I'm excited for is the battery life. Now you guys already know battery life on these was somewhat good. They weren't the best. You were really only getting about one extra charge with the case in itself. Now this version here, which is the version one, is only gonna last you about six, seven hours or something like that when it comes to using these that I've personally experienced myself. Now, when it comes to the Galaxy Buds Plus, they are rumored to have a larger battery in that one, and that one is going to give you about 11 hours of usage. Now, to me, seven hours, 11 hours, they both are good. I'm always for to get more battery power and more time listening to music when it comes to true wireless earbuds, but 11 hours, I'm not gonna lie, is very impressive. But the fact that I can get through a full workday, to me, is my measure of what is considered a good battery life when it comes to true wireless earbuds or even when it comes to a smartphone. So if I can get through eight plus hours of a battery life when it comes to using any device or using a true wireless earbud, then to me, 11 hours is no doubt a win now when it comes to using the actual charging case plus listening time with listening to music you're going to be getting about a total of 22 hours using your case along with the galaxy buds in itself so i think that is a huge win when it comes to an updated battery life to the uh, galaxy buds plus that we're looking to have on the brand new version now when it comes to talk time on these and i know phone quality on these was definitely the one thing that a lot of people are interested in to see if it's going to be better and definitely keep it locked into the channel if you are new because again i will be doing a full in-depth review of the brand new galaxy buds plus right here on the channel so definitely make sure y'all stick around for that but uh when it comes to talk time they are advertising about seven and a half hours that you are going to be able to get if you're doing straight talk time on the galaxy buds and then if you're using just talk time along with the case then you're going to get a total of about 15 hours when it comes to using these with talk time now one other feature that i'm super excited about when it comes to actually charging and battery consumption and that is the fast charging with the galaxy buds plus now it is rumored that we're pretty much going to be getting an hour of usage with just three minutes of charging that is just insane now when it comes to these right here you pretty much are going to be able to get about an hour and 40 minutes on 15 minutes of charge but the fact that they're able to knock that down to just three minutes and I'm still getting a full hour of charge and usage is pretty insane. So I'm looking forward to that as far as the fast charging capabilities. And to be honest with y'all, I haven't seen any earbuds or true wireless earbuds be able to charge 
give you guys about an hour of usage with just three minutes of charge, which is pretty insane. Most of them are about 15 minutes. Even when it comes to these with the AirPods Pro, they're about 15 minutes. My uh, Sony ones, I think, the uh, Sony ones that I have right here, these are the WF-1000X. These here are gonna pretty much give you the exact same, um, as far as 15 minutes, you're gonna get that good amount of boost of charge. But for three minutes, 60 minutes of usage, I'm here for it. Now, the other thing that I'm excited for is the fact that they're supposed to be giving us multi-device usage. Now, this is gonna be a feature that we have seen on things like the Apple AirPods and the Apple AirPods Pro when it comes to connecting to multiple devices. Now, what I mean by this is, for example, if I have my AirPods, I can connect to my MacBook Pro, I can connect to my iMac that's behind me, I can connect to an iPad, I can connect to multiple different uh, Apple devices with just one single connection. Now, it is rumored that the Samsung Galaxy Buds Plus is gonna have that multi-device connection feature that's gonna allow us to be able to connect to things like the Samsung Galaxy Tab S6 or a Samsung laptop or different things like that to be able to connect to multiple devices within their ecosystem along with another feature that I'm excited for that was recently leaked and I actually downloaded it right here on my phone, man, and that is the Samsung Galaxy Buds app. I don't know if you guys can see it. Let me turn down the brightness here but this is the official samsung galaxy buds app that is on an iphone that you guys can see right here so the fact that they're going to be able to give us the connection to be able to connect these up and be able to do some eq settings with an iphone is huge now before with the galaxy buds the original ones the gen ones you were only able to have the eq settings within the galaxy wearables app on a Galaxy device. So I'm super excited the fact that they're now are including Apple into having that app on here. And you guys can actually go out there right now and download it out in the App Store. Just type in Samsung Galaxy Buds Plus and it will pop up for you guys to be able to download. Now, another feature I wanna talk about that I'm super excited for is a new feature that they're calling like this Spotify integration. I'm not sure what the official name is actually gonna be, but essentially you're gonna basically be able to put a Galaxy Bud within your ear and I can do a press and hold on one of the earbuds or maybe it's gonna be on either or. You can do a long press and hold and basically what's gonna happen is it's gonna automatically launch the Spotify application. Now this is pretty much gonna be a partnership between Samsung and Spotify to allow the API to be able to connect to the Samsung Galaxy Buds to where you can launch the application with just a long press hold on one of the earbuds and then just like that, it's gonna be able to launch your application. Now I'm gonna be honest with y'all, I'm not 100% sure if this is just more of a gimmick to get more people to kind of buy these, or if it's really gonna be a feature that I use, because if I think about it from a usability perspective, if I'm pressing and holding just to launch the application, if I'm going into Spotify, I still need to pick up my device to be able to actually play the uh, album that I wanna listen to, unless there's gonna be some type of voice activation with Bixby to be able to uh, have Spotify uh, play an album that you wanna listen to or whatever. We're gonna be able to see, again, I will be testing all of that right here on the channel, so definitely stick around for that. But if that doesn't have that type of integration, then I'm not 100% sure on how often I would actually use that feature. But nonetheless, I still think it is a pretty cool feature that is on the Samsung Galaxy Buds Plus. And last but not least, before I get into the one feature I think is gonna be really huge on this, is I wanna talk about the colors. Now, as far as the colors, you are gonna be able to get, uh, these are gonna be in black, they're also gonna be in white, and they're also gonna be in blue and red. Now, I'm personally looking forward to the red one just because I have my AirPods Pro here, the ones I have custom painted that I have right here in black and red. So the fact that if I can get these in like a red, I think will be super dope. And plus it would match my entire aesthetics that I kind of have going on with the whole black and red theme with my uh, True Wireless earbuds that I have. But the fact that if I can get those in a red, I think will be dope. But the one thing that I'm hoping that they also do that I'm excited for is I'm excited for them releasing hopefully all of these colors everywhere on the launch date. Now the issue that I had with the Gen 1s is that they had the canary color, which was like this yellow color that they had, and that was literally the one that I wanted, but for some reason they only released it in certain parts of the world during certain times and you really couldn't get it within the US, and it was just like this whole thing, and I'm like, I wish they would've just announced it and released it, all of the colors, anywhere in the world, I can get any color, it doesn't matter where I live in the world, 
And so I'm hoping that is gonna be something that I can get the red pair from day one right out of the gate and they not just release the black and white pair within the US. So hopefully we can see those different options that we can have pretty much anywhere. But again, I will let you guys know. So definitely stick around here on the channel for that. Now, the last thing I wanna tell you guys about before I get out of here is I wanna talk about the gaming mode that is supposed to be on the Galaxy Buzz Plus. And that is gonna be a feature that is, I'm assuming is gonna be a tuning within the EQ settings within the Galaxy Wearables app or the Galaxy Buzz Plus app is gonna allow you guys to be able to tune specifically for playing games on your device. And that means like having a more immersive experience when it comes to you know listening to footsteps if you're playing games like Call of Duty or hearing gunshots from all around you or just giving you that more immersive experience with inside of an actual application like a Call of Duty or a game like um, uh, Apex Legends or a game like um, Fortnite or whatever that may actually be out there but I think this is going to be kind of a different mode that you're going to be able to have on your Galaxy Buzz Plus that I don't think any other true wireless earbuds actually offer. So I'm interested to test that out to see how well that's gonna be. So again, stick around for that because that will be coming on the channel. Well guys, that pretty much wraps up this video. If you guys have any questions about the Samsung Galaxy Buzz Plus, anything that you guys are looking forward to, go ahead and drop it down in the comment section below. I always get to you guys' comments as I like replying back to you guys and building that community as we grow together. So again, that pretty much wraps up this video. Thanks again for watching and I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.